So my name is Matt Spodnitz and I'm the National Library of Medicine Fellow in Biomedical Informatics at Columbia. Uh, originally, I'm from New York. In college, I was a chemistry major. So I'm a physician with experience in surgery and radiology, and certainly the interest of uses of informatics in radiology was something I heard quite a bit about, and that first got me interested in biomedical informatics. Then I came to the department and started using my breadth of experience in science and medicine to start working with the observational databases in the department. I'm from New York City and I went to Columbia for medical school, so I was familiar with the department and DBMI is one of the more productive research efforts that it, in, in Columbia Medical Center and so I thought that would be a very interesting place to work in. So I'm working with uh, Karthik Natarajan and I work with him as well as the Observational Health Data Sciences and Informatics or Odyssey Community. And what excited me about that is the opportunity to work with large databases in healthcare and generating real world evidence to improve it. So my most original project is looking at cervical cancer risk from intrauterine device or IUD use. And IUDs are used by about 100 million women for contraception. And we compared the cervical cancer risk for copper and hormonal IUD users, which are the two main kinds of IUDs. And we found that the cervical cancer risk was lower for the copper users. So I'm interested in investigating why that is and the pathophysiology of cervical cancer from IUD use. Yeah, I, I think that a physician offers a number of unique insights into the area of biomedical informatics. And one is that physicians understand the clinical relevance of the data we work with and, and how to interpret them. And so I found that in working with Odyssey and in other projects, I can help assess the relevance of what we find. I would say for people in high school and college, there are a couple of things that they can do. One, of course, is to be genuinely curious about a, a variety of topics in medicine or science, to get involved in original research relevant to their areas of interest, and to take classes in those kinds of subjects. Now that I have found a that there may be a difference in how copper and hormonal IUDs affect the human body. I'm interested in becoming an independent investigator on why that may be the case. I think that what informatics offers to clinicians is to generate data on unanswered questions and a very objective and scientific means of answering them. 